Assalamu alaikum dears. In this video, we will be explaining the history and development of semantics in the field of linguistics. The term semantics, it is a recent addition to English language. And there is no occurrence of semantics in literature till 17th century. It was first introduced in the paper presented to the American Philological Association in 1894. The title was Reflected Meanings A Point in Semantics. On the other hand, the French term semantic was introduced by Mr. Briel in 1893. But the major point is that in both the cases, the term was not used simply to refer to meaning. Instead, it referred to the development of semantics, what we can call these days historical semantics. In 1900, however, Briel's book, Semantics, study in the science of meaning was published in English language. This was the first time that semantics was introduced in terms of meaning. So it is a special point, the first occurrence of semantics in terms of meaning in 1900 by Briel. But generally this term semantics was not used by many other people Another interesting mention in this regard is the book written by Ogden and Richard, The Meaning of Meaning. It was published in 1923, but the word semantics does not occur in the main body of this book. It only appeared in the appendix of this book. And after 1930s, this term semantics was used by some linguists, but unfortunately some newspapers and some other linguists and scholars, they use semantics in other meanings rather than using semantics in terms of the study of meanings. Beside this, some other names were also used by different scholars and linguists, for example, semiology, semiology, semiotics, semimics, and semics. All these scholars and linguists were using these terms according to their own interests and orientation. This was a brief history of semantics. Thank you so much.